We can go market update and charts today. It's Tuesday, the 20th of February, 2024. Mike Smith, analyst at Go Markets, to lead you around what's happening today as we approach the midpoint of the Asian session. Of course, US markets are shut for the long weekend after Friday's weakness with all major indices closing lower snap and five day winning streak. European markets, which were open yesterday, closed slightly higher. US futures this morning have been slightly below, below neutral for most of the day. So far, Asian markets are generally following that uncertain European lead. ASX was trading near neutral for much of the session, but looks as though it's just dropping off a little bit around about 0.2% to the downside as we record this. And European equity futures pointing to a cautious open this afternoon. US dollar index, mildly high and trading mid-range. Outside of that, most commodities are pausing around key levels. Gold around 2020, copper just over the 200 MA and oil around the 200 MA as well. Bitcoin is also pausing around about 52,000, failing to gain after last week's strengths. And of course, end of earnings season will continue to influence sentiment. Today, the RBA minutes have released. No change in the BOC rates, although it was anticipated that there may be a little drop market didn't like that when it was first announced and Canadian CPI later. A couple of charts of core RI today. Oh, the Australian dollar yen is interesting. We've been trading in a range now for the best part of 48 hours. You can see there we've got an upside level of around about 98.22 and a downside level of around about 98 cents. So we're stuck in this 25 pip range and move either side of that looks as though it could be significant particularly if it's to the upside uh, but those rba minutes don't seem to have helped you can see it's been some time since we've breached this 98.22 possible move up in excess of 98.60 could it do this is potentially on the cards bld looks good to move higher again uh, we can see here we have this earnings jump here we had a little pause around about this 588 now we're over six dollars Following through on yesterday's move up today, possible move up to around about 660 is on the cards. That's around about a 7% return for from current price. Trade safe and see you again soon. Bye bye for now.